Newsflash, I don't watch the news, and I'm going to tell you why. I'm outside today because it is a gorgeous day in New Jersey. But I wanted to come on here and share with you why I don't do something that I think a lot of people do, and that is watch the news. Now, before those of you say, oh my gosh, Tammy, how do you know what's going on? There's a presidential election coming up. Shouldn't you be paying attention? I didn't say I didn't pay attention to what was going on in the world, but I don't watch the news. Why don't I watch the news? Because the last thing that I want to do is when I first get up in the morning or at night when I'm trying to wind down for my day, why would I want to completely suck down my vibration take in all that negativity and upset myself and make myself, you know, crazy. Let's think about it now. Because of the internet, because of social media, we know what's going on globally. It's not even just local news anymore. And it's a lot. Now, if the news station started putting in more positive stories about an amazing a miracle that happened or, you know, something that's, that's sort of uplifting, I would be all over it. That's just not the case right now. And I just, I don't want it to affect my vibration. I don't want to take on other people's things from across the globe. It's just not where I want to be. I want to stay uplifted. I want to stay happy. I know that I am sensitive. I know that I'm affected by it. Even if I read things online, sometimes I will get affected by hearing somebody else's story or hearing something that someone else has gone through. But I find that online, I can control it more than I can control what the news is bringing out to me. So, and again, it's rarely something positive. And it's not just local anymore. We hear about all over the world these horrible things that are happening. And it never, to me, seems to cover some of the beautiful things that are happening. So I choose not to allow it into my consciousness and into my awareness and into my vibration. Now, for those of you who are thinking, but then how do you know what's going on in the world? That doesn't mean I don't watch presidential debates. That doesn't mean I don't watch State of the Union addresses. That doesn't mean that I don't pay attention to what's happening in the world and I don't hear the things that are happening and I don't go online and look up specific things so I can understand what's happening when I hear about something or I'm told about something or I wanna research something. But that's me being in control of it. That's me going online to try and find out, well, what is this that everybody's talking about? And it doesn't, there's the images and all of that stuff and the, the video, it doesn't affect me the same way. So I'm still aware of what's going on. People around me tell me all the time different things that are going on. And I'm interested in what's going on in the world. I just don't want to take it in in that format because I know that it sucks my vibration down. It is affecting me, it's affecting my life, and I just choose not to take it in. So I just wanna put that out there for all of you. Think about how you're starting your day. Are you starting your day with a dose of negativity by watching the news, or can you just get that same information, looking things up online, just reading through some stuff, and then moving on with the rest of your day? Do you want to take that stuff on? And the same thing at the end of the day when you're trying to wind down and relax, is that something you want to take on? I remember interviewing Joe Vitale years ago, who is a law of attraction expert. He was in the movie The Secret. He said, I don't watch the news either. And I remember thinking, you know, I've always not been a fan of it. And now I can understand why. I didn't realize years ago how it was affecting me and how it was affecting the rest of my day and how it was affecting you know, my evenings and, and going to sleep and all of that kind of stuff, right? We have enough chaos going on in our lives. We don't need to directly take it in in that way. So that's why I choose not to watch it. I still know what's going on in the world. I'm still aware and I take it in doses that are acceptable for me to take in without it completely draining me and now I'm getting upset about something that happened you know in another state or another country or missing children or you know whatever it might be um, that I can't do anything about right I can't do anything about something that's happening that far away from me and so it's just gonna affect me and it's gonna upset me for those of you who are who are against this and and are all about watching the news God bless you if that's what's helping you and that's what makes you feel good. 
But if you find that you are disturbed by these stories, if you find that it's not making you feel good, you can still be aware of what's going on in the world. You can still do something about the different things and just take it in in a different format. That's all I'm suggesting because your vibration really does matter. It matters to you. It matters to the people around you. It matters to what you're taking in and what you're, you're manifesting in your life. And it matters to having your awareness open enough to hear the messages from the universe, to get the communications that are happening all around you all the time. And it, it really, really makes a difference what you're watching and what you're listening to. So I choose not to do it. I choose not to tune into it. And I'm still very well aware of what's going on. And I make the choice as to how much I want to know, how I want to know it, and what stories are important to me because we have this beautiful thing called the internet. And you can Google it and find things out and take it in in doses that won't affect you in the same way. So I just wanted to share that with all of you. Comment below. Let me know, do you watch the news? Are you for it? Are you against it? How do you get your news if you don't watch the news? Maybe I'll learn something new. And I wish you all a, a high vibe day and week. If you're watching this, subscribe to my channel so you don't miss other, other um, issues that I'm talking about and other videos that I'm making. And tag a friend on this as well and take them to this and let them know, listen, there's another way to find out what's going on in the world, especially if you know that person is sensitive, empathic, and drained a lot because it will make a difference. I will see you next time.